I am Cal Maradona, the retired Dean of Students from the Camden campus of Rutgers, the State University of New Jersey. I have a long career at Rutgers. I have actually been with Rutgers my entire adult life. I started as a freshman on this campus in 1969. And then when I graduated, I was offered a position and I have been in a number of positions at Rutgers. I've actually been here for 40 of those 60 years. So two thirds of its uh, existence, I was actually on campus and still passionate about Rutgers Camden. I met my wife at Rutgers, even though I went K to 12 with her uh, in elementary and high school, I met her actually here. And my daughter, of course, she just graduated from Rutgers, so, and my mother-in-law graduated from Rutgers, so there's a lot of Rutgers in my family. It really came from humble beginnings, the, the campus here uh, in Camden, and I think now it's, you know, it's a thriving, modern campus with all the facilities that students could want. Well, this, this collection here is uh, just a small part of what I actually have. But it started out just things that we would put together as promotional items for the campus to try to get students involved or get people involved with Rutgers. And so that started the collection. And then when eBay showed up on the scene and it, was, it became easy to find some unique Rutgers items, I started spending a lot of time on eBay to grow my collection. But most of the, uh, the collection in the box, uh, the cabinets here, are things that we actually created for the campus as promotional or giveaway items. The thing that I think I, I'm most proud of is the commemorative Coca-Cola bottle. One of the alums uh, from Rutgers, Ron Wilson, who was the president of Philadelphia Coca-Cola at the time, he interceded and helped us to get the smallest run of commemorative bottles Coke's ever produced. And we are the only campus in Rutgers to ever have a commemorative Coke bottle. My red vinyl records that I got on eBay uh, all Rutgers tunes and, you know, red vinyl, that was really the, uh, the clincher to, to, to pay, I think, $27 for it. We've always tried to do things to kind of promote Rutgers. So we've done a Rutgers Roast, which is a coffee that Melita produced. We've done Rutgers Root Beer, uh, a, an exclusive bottle of root beer uh, made for Rutgers. We have Are You Nuts, bags of nuts uh, that we would give out at events. Uh, Are You Cool Mints? So a number of Rutgers and Are You items to kind of promote the campus and, and bring attention to what we're doing here. We have attracted, I think, some top talent. Billy Joel was here, John Belushi, Kurt Vonnegut, Kevin Smith, Michael Moore, Vincent Price, some of the people we wanted we never got, like Bruce Springsteen, but I think we did a fairly good job of bringing a fairly good and diverse assortment of people onto the campus. Over the years, we've done, some, we've done some pretty interesting things. We actually had a miniature golf course in the student center, 18 hole miniature golf course, and we ran it like a golf outing where people have foursomes and there were prizes and the straightest putt and the longest putt and the most holes in one, uh, and we did it in February. Where would you go play golf in the middle of winter? Well, at Rutgers Camden, you could. The best feature of the Camden campus is its size. It's not really a large campus. It's a very small campus, so you can get around very easily. But the nicest thing about this campus is that when you come to Rutgers Camden, you're not in a big classroom uh, with TAs teaching your class. You get the top rated research faculty, even as a freshman. You come to Camden, you can get the top education and a more of a feeling of coziness. I can't imagine students not getting to know the faculty and the staff much better than they would on a larger campus. I think the thing that really identifies me as the most passionate person about Rutgers is my New Jersey license plate, which is R-U-T-G-E-R-S. Seven letters, Rutgers, the only one in the state of New Jersey. If you see me on the highway, I try to drive softly, quietly, but if I cut you off, you know it's me.